Marcus left it quite late, just ran out of time maybe? Yeah, I think so, but in the end we weren't good enough in the game, but at the end we were quite close, but obviously if we start better, we have to give ourselves a better chance to win the game. Two more goals for you today, that's a huge positive for you to take, isn't it? Of course, uh, when, when you get on, that's uh, what I'm looking forward to do, helping the team score goals, and obviously I got two today, but I didn't get the win, so... Stoke are a very physical team, do you think that kind of contributed to the slow start? Uh, I don't know what it, what the reason was, but we didn't start great on the ball, and uh, obviously second half when we regrouped, it looks very be much better, but obviously we need to start from the first first whistle. For you and Ivan, it's quite a, a partnership that doesn't happen very often, but when it does, did you enjoy playing with Ivan up there today? Yeah, yes, of course, it's, uh, it's good when you have two up top, it gives you more options to play, and then the link up is easier when you have, when you have someone like Ivan up top with you, and obviously it's a... <laughs> It's a good good combo. A few overall this season has been a positive start. Five goals, I think, now. How are you finding it? It's good. Uh, it's been good after the injury. Obviously, getting more minutes and minutes, but showing, showing the coaches that I, I can do more and more it, it coming to go, going to forward, so, which would be good. When you came on, what was the message from Thomas? Just go and do what you do? Yeah, of course. It's like you make an impact, and uh, I've done, done that, and uh, look forward to Tuesday now. Obviously, without the fans in this stadium, it is a bit of a weird atmosphere. How are you finding it? Yeah, it's a bit weird. It's very quiet since some some phases of the match up, but obviously you have to deal with it. And uh, I would hope that the fans would be soon back in some some way. But obviously, at the moment, it is what it is. Obviously, right at the end there, as you keep pushing and pushing, is it frustrating not to get that final goal to to maybe sneak a point? Of course, it's a it's a obviously lose is very difficult but I think you can take the positives out of this and negatives and we move on to Tuesday with a better mindset. Is it good to have games coming literally every few days because it gets this straight out of your system? Of course it is, because uh, next game is already on Tuesday so you have literally the journey back you can think about this game and then you're already thinking about the next one which is good.